guys and welcome back. It's Cam from Excel Gaming, and I have some uh, more information on the Revolution map pack. Well, same map pack. It's DLC pack, and uh, we've got four like multiplayer DLC maps. And uh, as you can see on the screen, we've got Hydro, Downhill, Grind, and Mirage, and uh, also the Darise map. The, you know the Zombies map. And uh, basically, all these maps is basically just really massive. And um, these come with the season pass. Also, uh, you know, if you bought the season pass, you know the four DLCs you get with it. These are the four you get: Hydro, Grind, Downhill, and Mirage. I don't think you actually get Dire Eyes. So. Um, I don't know if I show yet till you know tomorrow, which is the 29th, and which it comes out tomorrow. So maybe about after 12, you know. Uh, so for PS3 users, it won't be out tomorrow. So you know you get it like a month after or something like that. Uh, so uh, sorry about that. If you're a PS3 user, and uh, you won't be getting this tomorrow, you know, because you've only just had the Nuketown DLC. Uh, so, which came on the 17th of this month. So, um, going on to the Peacemaker, Peacekeeper, sorry, uh, it's an SMG. Uh, it comes with uh, the actual Revolution DLC map pack. So, you can buy it for about 100 Microsoft points, uh, I've been told. And uh, you can also, uh, maybe in the new map, Dire Eyes, I've heard also as well. Uh, but it will be in the multiplayer maps, and it may be in, you know, the actual Zombies map itself as well. But uh, there's uh, quite a few that's on the Zombies map as well. There's some new ones on there, on the Dire Eyes. So uh, I'm going to go on to the actual more depth of the uh, peacekeeper now so um yeah the peacekeeper is basically a better than any other gun it's like the perfect gun to use you know in multiplayer uh, so they made one like this uh, it's a bonus weapon as it says on screen here this will be amazing if this is an actual zombie you know like other zombie games uh, like modes like you know on transit and survival uh, and all that kind of stuff uh, but also uh, if it would be in the new you know the rise the rise um so and also it could be in green run you never know but anyway uh, either close up uh this is from uh, black ops 2 well you know the page it says here Revolution also delivers a bonus multiplayer weapon, the Peacekeeper, the powerful SMG, a complete campaign, and uh, this is another up close uh, of the game, like Revolution Info. Uh, it's a brand new multiplayer weapon, it's just going on about that. Pause it if you want to have a look at it. And uh, Hydro, that's a new multiplayer map we have. We have four multiplayer maps. We've got Hydro, uh, we've got this one, we've got a description here. Dodge the floodwaters to hold down an electrolytic dam in Pakistan. And uh, the second map, we have got a brand new, brand new, I think it's going to be awesome this one. Anyway. Here's a close up of what the next map will, well, is. So, uh, here you go. And now we have Downhill. Now, Downhill is a new snow map, the first new snow map on Black Ops 2. Uh, so, it says here take the fight to a new snow snowbound ski resort in the Re French Alps. So this one you can actually ride, well you can't ride in them I don't think, but uh, there's actually, you know, uh, carts going across the map every time, they don't, they don't stop. If you're in the way, it will kill you, as said on the trailer, for the actual uh, video of Revolution. And now Grid, now that is set in a skate park, 
it's meant it, no corners at all. It's all rounded. So they've got your tunnels, they've got your escape ramps, you've got everything, uh, benches, posters, you know, everything what you would find in a skate park. Uh, it says here, navigate ramps and half pipes within the massive skate park in California's Venture ben Beach. So that's pretty awesome. So a new environment to play in, you know, we're normally used to like buildings and all that, but this was outdoor one, so that's pretty cool. And now for uh, Mirage. Now that's like a deserty place. It's like a sandstorm coming swept across it. And it's all sandy. Uh, it says here, fight for control over a sand swept luxury resort in a goatly desert, desert. Sorry. And um, it's got a building at each side. It's a bit like Nooktown but bigger. And you can actually hide in the snow. Uh, like humps and uh, it's pretty awesome so going on to die rise now uh, which is kind of part of re revolution altogether that what like brings it together you know if you get me what I mean because uh, die rise we all want new zombie maps right so they've actually delivered they've gave us a new environment we've actually in a building you know like a tall building uh, I've got a picture of that in a minute, and uh, also, in I don't know, but if you can actually see that zombie, he's got white eyes, so you know that might be a new feature for the zombies we have. But anyway, this is the building that we're in. Now, uh, as you can see, in the top corner there, in the middle, uh, we've got like a meteor dropping down. You know, like we did in uh, the uh, Nooktown twenty. Not 2025, Nuketown Zombies, the DLC, what we got for Xbox 360 and PS3. And, um, it's, you know, you bring it onto this one, and uh, it looks pretty cool. But I also uh, think, well, you guys know that it's there and it is carrying on. So, we've got a new uh, screenshot here. And uh, you guys thought this was Malton. Well, uh, so to say, but it even because uh, Malton actually is in the new uh, map Die Rise, so, um, where we have got a screenshot. I'll show you that in a minute. And uh, as you know, in the new in transit on Greenland, uh, Malton actually has only one pocket. So and this guy's got two pockets here, and uh, you know it. It looks to be in. I don't know, but. This guy, it looks to be in a rough area there, like a cage there, a ladder, you know, so that means you can travel up and down on the map, so, uh, here's a new uh, screenshot here, as you can see there's Malton there, with the tie on, the, and only the one pocket, and uh, it looks to be using uh, the AK-47U, uh, is that, yeah, uh, and uh, the Remington there, so, you know, uh, we've got some pretty awesome guns, and uh, if you would like to actual check out the guns, and you can on the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 page on their website. But anyway, we've got a new mode in there. It's called Turned. Uh, you can actually use the mode in each map. As you can see, it's uh, on this uh, screenshot here. It's actually in, in you know the diner in green one. On transit, obviously, because uh, you can't actually spawn there, you know, without being on transit. So, um, pretty awesome. You've got the zombie, you actually, the zombie, actually, you have to get the humans, you know, so that would be quite fun. But anyway, it's two days ago, so not long, uh, including today, it's like two days. So, um, not long to go now guys uh, so one more day after this day and it comes it would come about 12 o'clock uh, you know about one o'clock in the store for you to buy if you've got season pass uh, you can get the four new DLC packs for free obviously just you know just like Nuketown 20 not I, I keep saying 2025 it's not it's Nuketown Zombies I know I keep saying it but Here's like a new, here's a screenshot I want to share with you. Uh, it says here, what is Black Ops 2 Grunge map? 
Anyway, there's like an event that Call of Duty is holding once the release date for the revolution. And now on the release date, these guys are going to come on, I think, and play with us. You know, like the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 team did. But anyway, that's it for today. You can check that out on the page, on the Facebook page for Call of Duty. But that's it, I've got to go. So bye guys, and I'll see you later. Hello guys, on the screen now you will be able to see three of my videos and uh, if you would like to subscribe to my channel do do that and uh, also uh, click below if you would like to watch any video on there or uh, just head to my channel and uh, check those out and uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys and I'll uh, see you later, thanks guys.